Miranda, you are radiant. Yes, I am, aren't I? I came as soon as I heard the news. Was it important? My dad is due just after two. Is he coming through Waterloo? No, through Charing Cross. Of course. Miranda. Yes? You're beautiful. When your father arrives, I shall ask for your hand in marriage. He's made me very happy, Willoughby. Hello! Daddy, how nice to see you again. Why, Jove, it's good to be home again, even if it is snowy. <laughs> in the middle of June. <laughs> My little girl, why, you look quite radiant. Yes, I am, aren't I? And who, pray, is this gentleman? This is Mr. Willoughby Pomfret. He's been seeing quite a lot of me. So that's what she's been up to while I've been away, eh? <laughs> in that case, young sir, you better do the right thing by me daughter. I was going to ask your permission, sir. Seems a bit late for that. Marry me daughter and make an honest woman of her. <laughs> and I've got the ideal gift for you, wedding gift for you, my dear. <laughs> Tis of no great value. Probably a good luck charm. <laughs> but it does have a curious inscription on the medallion. <laughs> May it bring you uh, good fortune and happiness, uh, and your uh, husband, um, um... Willoughby Pomfret, sir. Yeah, well, Willoughby thing, yes, I've got very good names. It's beautiful, Daddy, yes. and you'll treasure it always. Yes. Where is your luggage, your portmanteau? Ah, yes, that's following along with me, sir, from behind, yes. <laughs> Come in, this, this way. <laughs> Yes, this is me fancy woman. Oh, no, 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 handmaid. No, no, this is me servant. Yes, that's it, my faithful servant, Lotus Blossom. Follow me all the way from High Pole. High Pole from the River Kwan? Yeah, below Fu Chow. Near Chang Queen. Did you know it? No, never heard of it. Ah. <laughs> yes, yes, later, later, later. Right. <clears throat> yes. <clears throat> now then, uh, Lotus Blossom, this is me daughter, Miranda. I want you to serve her faith. Yes, uh, and this is a uh, future husband. Um, um, will it be Pompey? Yeah, will, will it be thing? Yes. <laughs> <gasps> Why did she do that, Daddy? I can't say, for sure. Damn Ch these Chinese, damn mysterious people, you know. <laughs> Inscrutable. Yes. Shall I ring for tea, Daddy? By God, I could do with a cup of the old mags at once. Right, come on. And some scones. You know, you can't get sputtered scones in China. How very inconvenient, yeah. sir. Dismiss. Tea and buttered scones for three, please. <laughs> <coughs> ah, it's for four, please, yes. May I say, uh, Sir Geoffrey, how pleased we are to have you back home again, and your lady friend. Yes, thank you, Mrs. Uh, Mrs. Um, uh, uh. Plumtree. Ah, yes, yes, <laughs> yeah, well done, yes. Uh, and uh, after tea, I'm going to take a bath. I must get out of these clothes. I can stop now, but now, later, later. Uh, I'll go, Daddy. Ah, Ah, uh, 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 come in, sir, this way, the weather is most inclement. May I ask your name, sir? You are Sir Geoffrey Quad. Well, at your service, sir. Famous ex Ferrara. The very same. And uh, may I ask your name? I am Mandarin of Hai Pong. I follow you here all the way to London. Whatever for? To represent a pendant and your daughter is wearing. She is very radiant. Yes, I am, aren't I? But, but, but I say, you can't just burst in here and return the, uh, demand the return of the pendant. Uh, I mean, just give it to me down as a wedding present. The pendant was stolen many years ago from the temple of the Yellow Dragon in Haipong. I must recover the pendant 
and return it to my tongue. Your tongue? Which tongue is that? The yin tongue. Not the yin tongue, little high bow. Oh, very sad. But why would you travel halfway round the world to recover, recover a worthless piece of oriental brass? A pendant is worthless to all but the brothers of my tongue. It also carried a cuff of the yellow dragon, bringing misfortune and death to all who possess it. Ah! Allow me to examine this medallion. Ah, it is as I thought. It is of pure gold. And inscribed on the back is the exact location of the treasure of the Emperor Chu Si Yang. Not so! And you, my friend, are no Mandarin. You are none other than Dr. Fu Manchu, Chinese master criminal. Ah, oh, so! Very clever to recognise me, Englishman. But who you are? Ah, this is, um... Have been posting? No, I am Miles Cavendish of the British Secret Service. Oh. Ah, so you are very clever, Englishman, but not clever enough. You will not escape this time, you yellow fiend. How so? You know me as Sir Geoffrey Bryce. But in fact, I am in Chief of British Intelligence in China. And so you see, Dr. Fu Manchu, we are one to two. Not so, Englishman, we are equal on numbers. Oh, so. so, you see, it's good of our Chinese to lie on fire. <laughs> Leave this room alive, you yellow swine. Please be careful, Willoughby. It's all right, Miranda. I have a black belt. <laughs> In you, Del. Stop! Look into my eyes. You are feeling sleepy. You are feeling sleepy. Powers will not work. Come towards me. Oh, you are in my power. <clears throat> Don't just stand there. Help me off. Oh, sorry, sir. Stand very still, you two. Stage manager is incompetent. This pistol refuses to fire. Well, I'm terribly sorry, old chap. I mean, look. <laughs> ah! Oh, oh, oh. I'm awfully sorry. You ruined a good pair of socks. Sorry. <laughs> now then, you two, do not move. Terrorize nature.
nation of the nation. <laughs> Done, sir. And now for his accomplice, Lotus Blossom. This is no Lotus Blossom. This is Limehouse Lil. The police have been after her for years. Call a constable. I would if I had my whistle. <laughs> ooh, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> they will be here soon. The wolves. <laughs> No, no, no! Constable! Arrest this woman. She is no other than Limehouse Lil. Do your duty. Very good, sir. Come on, Lil. Get on the neck. Double quick. Not how you fool this one over here. Oh, 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 right. Uh, sorry, miss. Ow! Come on longer with me, Lil. Officer, I'm innocent. I'll do anything for my freedom. Anything? I think today is my lucky day. Well done, young fellow, my lad. Um, whatever your name is. Will it be? No, Miles Cavendish. Well, well done anyway, whatever it is. <laughs> Anyone for tea? Oh, yes, rather. 